milestone today at Western Michigan University. The school officially began its pilot program for their autonomous shuttles. It's a story we first told you about earlier this month. News 8's Marley Ginter is here now to tell us more about it. Marley? Well, Sue and Brian, Lieutenant Governor Garland Gilchrist and other state leaders were in Kalamazoo today for the kickoff of the program. The shuttle is a $2.1 million private-public partnership funded by MDOT and the Michigan Mobility Challenge. The shuttle is designed to help students with mobility challenges get around campus. One of the challenges the team has faced is working with a vehicle that's around pedestrian populations. Well, during the trial, there's a safety operator that will ride in the shuttle, and there are sensors on the outside of the vehicle. The Lieutenant Governor got a chance to ride in the shuttle. He says research like this is vital to the future of Michigan. Having our academic community connected with industry, working alongside government, we can solve any challenge. And one of the big challenges that we need to solve over the next 5, 10, or 100 years is how people get from point A to point B, how goods get from point A to point B, how services get from point A to point B. And we are going to continue to be at the forefront of that movement. The pilot program is expected to last at least two weeks. The shuttle is not built to handle Michigan winters just yet.